hello welcome back to my job so today i'm going to uh, edit my template uh, let me show you which template i will be edit now okay this one this is the food menu template and as you can see here i am included all of this uh, editing software like photoshop ai okay other softwares also so if you know a little bit any uh, any kinds of editing knowledge about this list of software then you can easily edit this template and replace it this uh, food and information as yours let me show you how it's uh, work the first thing first yeah, after purchase you can uh, download this software and a logo bundle also so I'm extracting the software as you can see after extracted this whole thing you can get these files and i would like to recommend you to edit the photoshop which is super easy to edit and uh, also you can resize for your image just double click here make sure uh, adobe photoshop already installed in your computer or laptop if you see this type of error message uh, this is not an error message adobe says the font i'm using here this font is not included so you can easily uh, cancel it or you can uh, download this font by clicking or uh, once you uh, try to read it here then you can see, uh, get this font name you can easily replace or download this font okay first thing first you have to uh, check in few things to edit this template first of all you have to go to selecting the uh, move selection tool and after when you select the move selection tool you can see the auto selection bar over there and maybe uh, it was like this you have to check in this auto selection bar and after that go to the window menu and check out the layer option f7 layer option once you check it then the layer showing right there make sure you're using the layer option and my design all design are in a separated folder which is easy to understand what type of image or which content you would like to change very easily as you can see the, the food item if you turn off the eye icon as you can see the image area are gone so you can easily understand this is the image area or this is also area image area so if i change the logo just click the logo and double click the vector option you have to double click it a new windows will appear here or adobe illustrator will appear here also you can change or replace it by here photoshop also photoshop here let me show you how and in this gray color area once you click it then you can find out the shape area uh, let me replace a image right there just selecting here and go to your folder i'm going to download a dummy image to show you how it's work i'm going to photoshop and this okay and just drag it up or stretch it a little bit fix this shape area properly and once it's done just simply the arrow check mark here the image will automatically fit this area but as you can see the shape uh, uh, u-shape is not showing right there so you have to do right click on the image and go to create clipping mask that's it the image are automatically fit to the shape another one here i'm going to the image store and drag here the image and i press the shift to drag it down my images like this and rotate it a few times once it's done take it here right click fit clipping marks also you can after clipping marks you can also edit 
as you want or place or drag something now here image again i'm pressing the shift and drag it up or down to resize the image into the box and once it's done take it right click create clipping marks so doing a few more time just doing same process over and over again until it finished right click yeah it's done so simple so once you change to text i'm going to press the alter button and um, scrolling the mouse wheel to zoom in out also you can use this zoom button by pressing the plus icon or hit the minus right this and click the text and pressing the text right there and the photoshop face me the font missing no problem i'm just hit the ok button and the photoshop automatically match uh, any kinds of font which is already i installed so you can easily download or easily use any font you want let me show you a free font site go to google and search in the font Here you can find lot of font as you as you want and all of the font are free so don't worry about it which one you would like to use on your template just download it and install and after that go back to photoshop and search the font here i'm using here this font for example so you can use any kinds of font as you want so simple also you can edit also you can change everything the color and the paper as you can see here is the polygon area so double click here a small window will be appear around your new window or coming up so if you change this color to orange or any kind you like yes you can easily drag it anywhere click the color automatically change press ok it's done if you like to change the dimension the whole template area i will i recommend you after finishing the whole template you just simply click everything uh, press the first folder and sh press shift and last folder all folder are selected let's control g to group them together if i missed another folder no problem select group and ctrl g right click merge whole image is now single image. don't worry about this line this is the bleed area if you're not interested to watch it just click here and drag it up here we are gone so go to image size and press it which size you want if you uh, I'm using pixel if you wish you get like two inch so I'm writing uh, I'm using 8.75 and 8.11 also inch yeah, I think this is perfect if you not like uh, if you not like this uh, size you can easily change anytime let me show you I would like to change it 10 and here 15 Press okay Photoshop are calculating okay need to wait a few more times it's depend on your PC how fast your PC or how slow uh, at the same time I'm uh, recording that is why my PC is still load time okay it's done if I check it again my width is 10 and height is 15 so i'd like to a width around 11 also 
that's perfect and then your template is ready to print so i hope this template is really helped you a lot and you can easily edit or replace it by your content hope you like this video if you would like to order this template so go to my shop here is my shop and i am already upload so many templates or if you I would like to any personal order or personal design you can easily contact me with my EC. I'm trying to help you uh, to design as you want but lowest cost so if you have any more question you can easily ask, send me a message and I hope you enjoy this video thank you so much see you next time